I know you've been involved in the translation efforts. Why is that a particular interest of yours? Well, I think, again, providing access to the literature, you know, I can still pick my way through the first page of the Forbits. I still get the Yiddish Forbits, and I try dutifully to, you know, to read the first page. But it's, it's imperfect at best. Uh, I would have a hard time reading a Yiddish book beyond an elementary level. Sadly, I mean, at, at some time in my life, I could have done it just fine, but I lost it. And it's, it's, for me, it's hard to regain at this stage of my life. But I'm interested in knowing what's in those books. So, you know, Elaine and I have taken some courses uh, with some local professors over the year. We have a group of a dozen couples where we meet once a month with professors of Judaic studies from University of Michigan and other places. And you know, last year we read Peretz and uh, Shalom Aleichem. And uh, so it's great to read the classics in, in translation. And I doubt that anyone in the room could have read them in Yiddish. And it's really revealing. Oh my goodness, look what's here. I suppose, uh, you know, for the same reason that my wife and daughter went to Stratford this past weekend, they saw Macbeth. You know why? You know it's a 500-year-old play. Why? Why is that relevant and important? And the place was packed. It's because uh, it's it's a window to uh, a time in history, to how people thought and wrote, and it's interesting. It's fun, right? I mean. I've given the railroad stories in translation to lots of friends who who wouldn't know Yiddish from you know from a cauliflower. They they couldn't figure out a word of Yiddish, and you give them the railroad stories to read, and they they are just blown away by the humor in them and the the great writing. Right? Those are as witty and interesting today as they were a hundred years ago when they were written. Why should we de be deprived? Why shouldn't we have access to that literature, right? Should it remain buried? I don't think so. But I didn't understand that all until I, I had the good fortune to stumble on the book center. And I, I probably wouldn't understand it today.